Hurry! Hurry! I can't wait! Waiting is impossible! Hold your flames! You're not the only one that's excited! That's right! Capsaicin Cookie is gonna win, I'm sure! There's no one better than him! You betcha! And even if someone had second thoughts, the show he put on during the Triple Cone Cup's trials surely made everyone change their minds. Ha-ha! <laughs> Long live the Spice Overlord! Quiet! Everybody knows Capsaicin Cookie hates that name! Then how about the King of Flames? Got a fire! Everybody's gathered. Let's go or they'll be without us. Is everyone here? Latecomers will have to run to the Mountains of Trials in Harmony. You'll have to run even if you're on time, though. As you all know, the Triple Cone Cup is a prestigious competition between the three academies with a long history that goes back to... Doesn't matter. What matters is that we didn't win last time. The time before that, the time before that, the time before that, and... Too long! We want Capsaicin Cookie! Precisely this year is going to be different. For now, our champion is none other than Cap Saison Cookie, who wields the full might of space. Cap Saison Cookie, think you can win this time? Wrong question, Headmaster. Ask how big a feast we're going to have after we return victorious. <laughs> Spice will prevail! Scovilia will prevail! <laughs> I'm the spiciest of the spiciest! I'm not gonna lose to a sad bunch of bland normies! Lord of Spice! Lord of Spice! Capsaicin! Champion! Cause I'm flaming hot! Now let's go! Let's go get that shiny cup! <laughs> the mountains of trials and harmony, but the air smells like nothing. This is the place. Huh? Look at that airship. The Krem Knights. <sighs> uh, the spicy scent. Must be the students from the Scovillia Academy. Queen Amon Cookie, you need not concern yourself with them. Yes, do not worry about that ragtag bunch, Queen Amon Cookie. They will be smart to avoid provocations. Whoa! Look at that cookie's ginormous sword! She's handling it like it's a twig. Ah, uh, there aren't too many of our own who are that strong. Cut it out! Soon, those stuck-up paladins will taste the power of spice! <laughs> paladins, this is our chance to demonstrate the superiority of our values and beliefs! Yes, sir! Oh, swift moves! If anyone's looking for a fight, hit me up! <laughs> Huh. Do you smell something sweet? Uh, the smell of fruits. Must be the Parfadia delegation. Wonderful. The other delegations have already arrived. Ugh. Who would have known the magic flight would be so unpleasant? I think I need a moment here. Well, first timer, are we? Well, I have just the potion for your nausea. Yours for just 5,000 coins. Uh, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm good. 
never turn away from goodwill, they say. Here, let's see if your potion will help me from my dizziness. Mm. 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 It's good. Very good. Oh, the formula is quite refined indeed. And it worked right away. Brilliant. That's a true Parfadian here. Our hopes are high, Prune Juice Cookie. Looks like the other champions are formidable opponents. It won't be an easy win. The Parfadians are as strong as they are sweet. Huh, really? Does it mean that potion cookie is strong too? We are gonna win, though, right? Ha ha! Wonderful! Each delegation arrived just on time. Welcome, my friends. Uh, huh? My name is Delato Trio Cookie, and I am the groundskeeper for the Mountains of Trials and Harmony. Let me introduce you to the cookie in charge of rules and announcements. Gelato Trio Cookie! Next, let me introduce you to the commentator of the tournament. Gelato Trio Cookie! And lastly, let us not forget about our valiant head of security. Gelato Trio Cookie! Looks like they're a bit... understaffed. Are you ready for a warm welcome ceremony? Then it's time you proceed to the tournament field. Ah, just look at the bright faces of our three champions. I never get tired of the excitement about the upcoming tournament. I am honored to proclaim that the Triple Cone Cup has officially begun. May this tournament be a celebration of the profound and timeless friendship between the three academies. Long, long ago, in times beyond memory, in the age when order and chaos coexisted, when dessert monsters roamed freely across the land, there were three cookies. A knight of rich and noble butter. A wizard who reshaped the world with the power of fruits. And the world, spiciest of all. You could not imagine three cookies more dissimilar. And yet, after countless adventures, Fate brought them together. But who was the strongest of the three? And for three days and nights, they fought and fought, but none could prevail. After a long skirmish, when all the three flavors were soundly mixed up, at this very place, atop the mountains of trials and harmony, one cookie spoke. Let us three take up princesses. If us three cannot find the answer, let us see whose values, wit, and skill prove to be worthy of living on. And so they parted ways. Soon, the three schools were built. The very schools whose champions have gathered here to compete in the Triple Cone Cup. On behalf of the three founders and all the champions before you. I greet you here at the Triple Cone Cup. You are the new generation to carry this tradition into the future. Now then, champions, are you prepared to find out who is the strongest of the three? May the strongest emerge victorious. Demonstrate that your hard-earned skill, superior intellect, an ever-burning spirit is worthy of the Triple Cone Cup! May the tournament begin! Show them your fire, Capsaicin Cookie! Queen of Mud Cookie! Show them what a true paladin is capable of! <laughs> yeah! Let's see what you sweetlings are made of! Those cookies are obviously very excited. We can't let them win! Parfaitina! Parfaitina! <gasps> the excitement in the air! The roar of the audience! I bet every cookie here is anticipating a fierce competition! This is the end of the welcome ceremony. But 
Lawrence. There is something missing, don't you agree? Champions and honorable delegates, you've come a long way. So enjoy the rest of the day to your heart's content at the Welcome Feast. Welcome to the Triple Cone Cup. <laughs> that was one fine feast. Can't see the cookie. Do you think we really can win? Why you? The competition hasn't even started, and you're talking weak already. What is going on here? Headmaster. Oh, sorry, punch. Tough enough. It's gonna be a good opportunity for you lot to learn that there's a lot of cookies in the world who are bland and strong. We... we are doomed. What is all this nonsense that I hear? Where is your flaming Scovillian spirit? Did it all waft into the local clean air? Yes, the world is vast and full of formidable foes, but real defeat is the defeat of the spirit! Don't you agree, Capsaicin Cookie? Are you ready to demonstrate the full might of Scovillia at tomorrow's trial? Ha <laughs> ha! Of course! For I and the fire that will burn anyone who dares to stand in Scovillia's way! Yeah, Capsation Cookie is our champion! Show them what the word spicy means! Queen Amon Cookie, may the light bring you victory. You are the paladin we all aspire to become. Ah, the glorious light shines through you! It pleases me to see such bright young paladins. Elder Vanilla Sugar Cookie, and that's Sir Financier Cookie. Financier Cookie, at your service. Elder Vanilla Sugar Cookie is under my protection. I have seen many triple cone cups with these eyes. The once little sparks of light were forged by the trials and grew into brilliant lights, shining in the glory of our Republic. Young Queen Amon Cookie, may you shine the brightest of them all. And may the glory of the Celestials keep you safe. I suppose it is time we take our leave. Sir Financier Cookie? Yes, Elder Vanilla Sugar Cookie. Queen Amon Cookie, your light shines farther than you might think. Remember this. The Celestials will guide you, step by step. Oh! To be personally greeted by Elder Vanilla Sugar Cookie and Sir Financier Cookie is a tremendous honor! Queen Amon Cookie, I know that you'll win. There is no doubt in that. Those Scovillians, huh? They do look spicy, but looks can be deceiving. I wonder what they're truly made of. I hear they call their champion the Spice Overlord. And the Parfadians. There is a saying. Not even Parfadians themselves can predict their own magics. But they are no match for Queen Amon Cookie. Hear, hear! Our champion is prepared for everything. Of course, noble paladins. After all, I haven't lost a single fight. Surely, this tournament won't be any different. We can win, right? I wonder if Prune Juice Cookie really has what it takes to win. Always fiddling around with his potions, neither does he excel at cream incantations, nor is he particularly great at jelly defense spells. What if we pick the wrong cookie as our champion? But... I must admit, his potions are pretty effective. They say he can even brew a sick leaf potion for you. Is that so? I'd be the first to try that one out. <laughs> Looks like we will have a chance to witness his potion brewing prowess in action. Oh! 
professors My esteemed colleagues have arrived to wish our champion good luck directly. Speaking of, where is our prize champion, Prune Juice Cookie? He's preparing his potions. He told us to not bother him. But the feast has only just ended. Remarkable! What an honor it is to have such a diligent student. Oh, we did our best to arrive as soon as possible. Yet we are late once again. Huh. Potion making is a fickle craft. One minor change can make everything awry. Let's leave the well-wishing for a later occasion. Yes, the last thing I'd want to do is pester a student with my nagging before an event of such great importance. Ah, a pity. Well, make sure to cheer on our champion for us. <laughs> well, yeah. I'll try. Whew. I was afraid all that spice in the air would affect my formulas. But it seems it can't reach here. Good. Hmm. It's me against a spice overlord and her holiness. <laughs> Nothing really unexpected here, huh? Now, the real question is whether my ingredients will be delivered on time. Oh, whoops! I almost spilled that. Focus, prune juice cookie, focus! We've got a lot of work ahead of us. Good morning. Good morning, esteemed guest. Did everyone have a restful sleep? The triple cone cup is about to begin. Allow me to walk you through the rules. The tournament will consist of three trials. Pass a trial, and you will receive a valuable relic left by our ancestors. Who will be the cookie? to claim the relics and take the Triple Cone Cup home. Hmm? The Noble Gelato Trio Cookie thinks that it might be a knight, huh? so valiant and brave. Hmm. The Peacock Gelato Trio Cookie is sure that it might be a wielder of Scovillia's scorching spice. <sighs> but the Sweet Gelato Trio Cookie predicts that it might be a scholar well versed in the magic of desserts. Ha <laughs> ha! May the victory be claimed by the most worthy! Dear guests, are you ready for the Triple Cone Cup Tournament? <laughs> Here, on the mountains of trials and harmony, envied by the land and piercing the very sky, a great battle of ambition Tis time for the first trial! <clears throat> this broadcast was made possible by our generous sponsors at the Parfadia Institute, who gracefully provided the all-seeing jelly visor. Do not miss a speck of flower with the utmost precision and impeccable quality of Parfadian magical optics! <laughs> Dear guest, allow me to introduce our astonishing contenders! Champion! Please enter the arena! Spice above all! Yes, race and cookie for the win! The light will bring me victory! Queen of Mom Cookie's victory is inevitable! <laughs> so that's who I'll be dealing with, huh? I see the three champions are in good spirits this morning. Before we begin, I must explain the rules of the first trial. Champions, your goal is to light up the great bonfire. We have placed a torch at each champion's starting position. A red one for Scorilla, a yellow one for the Kremlin's, a blue one for the Parfadia Institute. Now, do you see the great bonfire fashioned in the shape of the triple cone cup at the center of the arena? The winner of the first trial will be determined by the color of the flame at the end of the given time. Me! 
May the spiciest cookie win. Me! Ha 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 ha! Oh, flexing your muscles from the very beginning, are we? <laughs> My dear cookies, you won't even make it to the bonfire in time. Ha 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 ha! The youthful vigor. Shepherds, are you ready? Well, the first trial starts now! with that sword of yours. Huh. I'll leave you two to it. Witness the power of spies! Ah! He set the entire arena aflame! Such power. Impressive. Ouch! Oh, hot, 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 hot! Ha, 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 ha! It's... Just as I expected, charging head first with all that ridiculous strength of his. And I have just the item for that. This is not the time for refreshment. Yeah! Oh, don't worry. I'm aware of that. Watch this! What do we see? Goon Juice Cookie is running over the Lake of Baga! Huh? What? He's gonna burn to a crisp! Is he... that desperate? And while the other champions are there frozen in confusion... Goon Juice Cookie has lit the Great Bonfire! But... is the champion all right? Whew. I can barely keep my eyes open. Unbelievable! Goon Juice Cookie is unscathed! And the fire seems to be going out as well. <laughs> you must be crumbling to know how I did. Well, let me introduce you to a special little potion of mine. Don't you dare think it's over yet. Bond cookie pushes away prune juice cookie. The great fire turns yellow. What an unpredictable competition. Dear guest, keep your eyes wide open. <laughs> I like you two. I thought only us Scovillians weren't afraid of fire. Then how about this? Oh. Prune juice cookie. Incapacity, and I can't believe my own eyes! With a single strike of his fist, Capsaicin Cookie has turned the whole arena into a volcanic crater. Oh, light! Capsaicin Cookie rushes towards the bonfire. And lights up the red flame of Scovillia! I thought my job was tough, but this is beyond the scope of cookie capabilities. Oh, I'm I'm just a frail little cookie. Do you think that's fair? <laughs> Where is this smoke coming from? Another potion? Oh, now you want to hear about my potion, huh? Oh, what a joyous moment. This is Prune Juice Cookie's special potion, Liquid Smoke Screen. He, he's speaking right into the all-thing Jelly Miser! And I'm going to use this brief moment of confusion. Now, where do you think you're going? Light, guide me. So bright I can't see a thing. Smoke is going away. Fire! What color is the fire? Oh. Yes! It's yellow! 
Oh, ho! A reckless move. I didn't expect you to dive right into the smoke. If you can do it, so can I. I will never run away from the challenge. For that is the way of the true paladin. Whoa! Huh. If Capsaicin Cookie is the reckless charge first type, this one here is an honest noble knight. Both are very straight and to the point, and frankly, simple. Looks like I could use that to my advantage. <laughs> what a trial! Can anyone here predict the outcome? I sure can. not Will it be Queen Amon Cookie with the Toe of Pure Light? Or Capsation Cookie, the Lord of Fire? Both have great chances to win indeed. Champions, you have one minute left! Looks like Capsation Cookie is on the move. Will the Scorching Champion succeed? It doesn't matter. I'll light up the bonfire again and again! Ha! A paladin never gives up! I'll burn it up! Time is running out! 13 seconds! 12 seconds! This is not over yet! You! Stop right there or I will... Yeah! <coughs> what? What did you do? Is that... Jam? No! There is no way! I... I used the blunt end on purpose! Six! Five! Four! Quick! We must take him to the infirmary! Hey! Trio commentator! No need for the infirmary. <laughs> gotcha! Huh? One second left! And... The flame burns blue! The first trial is over! I can't believe it! Boom Juice Cookie used the confusion to snatch the victory from his rival's hands! There is only one thing the relic to be granted to our first winner! Prepare to witness the Skolvilsky Manuscript, containing one of the three founders' spicy secrets. What secrets does it hold? We might never know, but Prune Juice Cookie will certainly get a chance. It is yours, champion! Yes, yes, thank you, thank you. My name is Prune Juice Cookie, the potion. I still can't believe it! He was spouting jam just a moment ago! Oh dear, why the long faces? I suppose I owe you an explanation. There are many students within the walls of our esteemed school. Naturally, some of them are <laughs> lazier than others. And what is the best way to skip classes without punishment? Sickly! And what you have witnessed some moments ago was my carefully crafted potion to cater to the needs of the student collective. The infamous It's Not Alive potion. That can make your dough cold and stale for some time. I must admit it's one of my finest creations. Rest assured, my customer's anonymity is guaranteed. But the jam from your injury! Ah, the jam. Theatrics. It's more fun with special effects. <laughs> you should have seen your faces. <laughs> if you will the power to move the earth or have gods and deities watching over you, surely a cookie or two crumbling in some tournament shouldn't bother you. <laughs> this 
is the problem with you gifted cookies. Such arrogance. Ugh. Oh, but I suppose I owe you my thanks, because I won. <laughs> now, if you'll excuse me. I'm so sorry I let you all down. Come on! Tough it up! This is only the beginning. You're gonna crush them all! Right! Now everybody knows how strong you are. Yeah. We believe in you, Capsation Cookie! You're gonna be the winner! Thanks, y'all. Yeah, there's gonna be another chance to win. Trust me, I'll bring victory to Scovillia. And then, we're gonna have a feast here, all together. I'm gonna show the world that Flamin' Hot is where it's at! Cookie! That cowardly wizard using such dishonorable tricks to win! He also had the nerve to lecture our Queen Amon Cookie! The audacity! Please, stop. Queen Amon Cookie? Do not say a word. I don't want to hear about it. Cowardly? Even so, a victory is a victory. After all, he was right. Perhaps I thought too highly of myself as the champion of the Krem Knights. Besides, did I even have a chance against the Scovillian champion? No, I must win. Everyone is expecting me to win. But I'm not sure anymore. Not after today. That was... a legit win, wasn't it? A win is a win! Who cares? Hmm. Clearly, potions have potential. I've never heard about that sickness potion, though. I gotta say, that prune juice cookie must have been pretty discreet about his little... operation. He could have had half of the Institute expelled. I wonder what his formula is. Anyhow, Prune Juice Cookie was lucky to win this time, but I still don't believe he has what it takes to claim the cup. Mm. Yeah. Who knows? <laughs> I guess we'll see about that. Ha ha ha! Good morning, esteemed guests. <sighs> These ancient walls greet another dawn. The second try has only one simple move. The first champion to come out of the Harmony Grove wins. But the task itself is far from simple. The Grove is teeming with eerie shadows and dark secrets. Once you step under the mighty old branches, you're on your own. It looks like our champions have already arrived at the Grove's Edge. All seeing Jelly Visor, can we have the picture? I'm not gonna go easy on you today. Since last night, I've become even spicier. Even spicier? Oh goodness, what do I do? Holy light! I think I understand why they call you the Spice Overlord. I'm not really fond of that name. I prefer my name, Capsaicin Cookie. As you say, I'm going to win anyway. This is my chance to redeem myself. That was surely a cunning victory yesterday, Prune Juice Cookie, and a well-earned one. But who will emerge victorious this time? Gelato Trio Cookie, what do you think? Hmm, who knows? Since this is the second trial, perhaps... Would you look at the time? You'll have another chance to voice your predictions. Let the second trial begin right now! Yeah! Huh. Uh... 
Yeah, be careful, you two. It's uh, getting dangerous here in the back, you know. We have dry fruit bats chasing us, and now sour string spiders. Your safety is the least of our concerns. And for your information, we're competing with each other here. Now stop complaining, come forward, and fight! <laughs> but you two are doing such a great job getting rid of those obstacles. I'll only get in your way, really. Ugh, whatever. That's it, I had enough. Out of my way! Uh, just a friendly reminder, it might be unwise to use your fire around all these trees. Hey -ya! I admit, it was rather effective. <coughs> Dust! You turned the whole place upside down! Seriously, that boom fist of his gives me chills whenever I see it. Boom fist? Did you just come up with that? I like it! I think I'm gonna steal that name. Wait! Look ahead! Looks like we have three roads to choose from. No, don't say that the time to part ways with my stalwart protectors has finally come. Oh, woe is me. It means that each one of us must take our own path, right? Oh well. Remember, the first cookie to leave this nasty forest wins. So long, my friends. <laughs> <laughs> we shall see about that. Oh, the road is getting narrower and the forest is getting darker. Creepy, even for a spooky old forest. I don't even know what to expect anymore, huh? Hmm. What? There's something ahead. A door? A door in the middle of the forest. Ha! Huh. This place is even more creepy and decrepit on the inside. Very well. How are you gonna scare me now? Oh? Now this is quite unexpected. What is this place? The entire hall is made of mirrors! What kind of trial is this? All right! I'm prepared to face any foe. Know that Queen Amon Cookie never gives up nor surrenders. Nobody? Oh? The entrance... It disappeared? I see you. The noble paladin with dough imbued with the brightest rays of light. Draw your sword. Prove that you are a knight that knows no defeat. For only a true paladin may emerge victorious. I shall draw my sword. For a paladin never backs down from a challenge. I was simply looking inside the mirror. You know the code of the Krem Knights. Are you one of us? Trials of mirrors of some sort, is it? Whatever it is, I am prepared to take it! Witness my victory! Ah! Am I walking in circles? Mirrors! Mirrors everywhere! I was looking at my reflection, but then... My wrist... It hurts! The shackles... are back? No! No shackles! Not anymore! I... I've learned how to control my power! It's true! I can do it! I... I did my best to contain my powers. I've never lost control! I've suppressed myself enough. Please! No shackles! I beg... Please! No!
cream juice cookie? With a heavy heart, I must inform you. Oh, not that old tune again. Without any doubt, you are one of the most diligent, most hard-working students. Must you remind a cookie of his traumatic past? That's too much. Even for me. However, the facts speak for themselves. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm pretty happy with my potions, you know? Let's get over with the old unpleasant memories. As your professor, I've done everything I could. But I must conclude that you are simply incapable of learning magic. Perhaps there are other careers that you will find interesting? Nothing more than a memory it might be. But it hurts just as much, Professor. is over once a paladin loses her sword. You have lost eight times. Say it. Admit your defeat. Or perhaps you still harbor your delusions. That you can win this battle? No. No. I don't think I can. Time after time, I lost. But... But... I don't want to admit it. Because as a paladin, I simply will not give up! But? You are trembling. I sense hesitation in every swing. In every step. <sighs> this is the ninth time. A paladin must know when to yield. A tenet of the Krem Paladins yet unknown to you. Go ahead. Say it. Admit your defeat. I... I can't! Tenth. If it were your life at stake, it would have been long but over. I hate it. I hate that I cannot admit my defeat. But you are correct. I've been defeated. Ten times. Ten harrowing times! Say it. But that's why. Admit your defeat. The more I think about it, the less I'm afraid of losing. The only thing that was proven is that you're simply more skilled. I can still move my arms and legs. I can still keep fighting. <laughs> How foolish of me. True defeat is only when one gives up. Denial of truth. <laughs> Desperate delusions. This is not the way of a paladin from the Krem Knights. I don't care. For I shall fight until my last crumb. A paladin who does not fear defeat. This is my way! Why, Queen Amon Cookie? Why do you persist? Your dress is in tatters, and nothing will change the outcome. Oh, but everything else has changed. I've learned a lot about you, and I shall keep fighting. Until the very end! Yeah! <sighs> Indeed, you have grown. You defeated me this time.
Victory is yours. Take it. The mark of victory. Go, and stay true to your beliefs. So what if my dress is ruined? I can look myself in the mirror and smile, knowing that I gave it everything I had. Yay! Huh? Queen Amon Kalith was the first to come out. She is the winner of the second trial. The second trial will be officially over when the two other champions... Huh? Look! Capsaicin Cookie's Hall of Mirrors! It's on fire! What? It's Capsaicin Cookie! Since we already have our winner decided, we will execute our extraordinary right to intervene. Dispatch the rescue gelatos! I'd like to ask our esteemed audience to remain calm, as it is absolutely impossible for the fire to reach your seats. Our specialist will contain the situation within 10 minutes. Queen Amon Cookie? Oh, looks like Queen Amon Cookie has another plan. The Crim Knights' champion is headed towards Rune Juice Cookie's Hall of Mirrors. I am certain that a bright young cookie such as yourself can excel at ahem, almost any field. And I will do all in my power to help you set on a new path. Hmm. What was it I said back then? No, can't remember. Professor, you mentioned almost any field. Naturally, that is excluding the study of magic and such. No talent for one thing, no luck with others. So what exactly are you suggesting that I do then, hmm? Mm. Yes, yes, I know. You've done everything you could for me. After all, it's my Doe's fault that I have no magic abilities. I'm sorry. If only I could share some of my magic with you, I would do it without a doubt. Oh well, there's no need. You know it's not possible. But don't worry too much about me, Professor. <laughs> like I said, I've been doing pretty good with my potions. And have you heard? I was chosen as the champion of the Parfadia Institute for the Triple Cone Cup. So, with all that being said, I think it's time for me to go. Frankly speaking, this conversation is not pleasant at all. Looks like the goal was to face the demons from your past. I guess I can check that one off. I guess this is the moment where I magically find my old scrolls and spellbooks and tear them apart into a million little pieces once again. No? Oh, but I didn't even do anything yet. Crunches Cookie, I need your help. My help? Wait, but you're already here, so... I take it that the winner has already been decided. Yes, you're right. And if you're all done here, please follow me! Capsaicin Cookie is in grave danger! What? In grave danger? Him? Yes! Let's go! Oh, sure. I'm coming. Would you look at that? Is... He really in danger here? To me, it looks like everything else is in danger. It's both! Uh, do you still have that potion you used in the first trial? Do I look like some magical potion cabinet to you? The one that gives you a potion of your requirement? Well, sort of. It's actually true. Prune juice cookie never comes unprepared. I do happen to carry a special tincture that allows the user to swim in bubbling lava. I call it the I'll be back potion. <laughs> That's a very helpful name. Rest assured, it works. But it works for no longer than three minutes. 
You'll have to be quick. That will do. Just to double check. Are you coming with me? Oh, no, 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 no. A fragile little cookie like me should stay here. Instead, I'm gonna mess around and stop the flames from spreading. I've been suppressing my flames forever. So that I... I wouldn't hurt anyone. Holding back. To what end? I've been restraining my powers so that I wouldn't hurt anyone. No longer. I won't be shackled any longer! Yes, these flimsy old chains will melt away in no second. I can get rid of them like I did before. And burn. Burn it all! Yes! Burn! Capsaicin Cookie! Taking care of the fire. What happened to Caps? Huh. Queen Amon Cookie, behind you! Something is coming out of the hall. A, a burning chain? Run! Um, but I'm too tired to run. Seriously? What would you two do without me? Sheesh. Is that something to say to the cookie who gracefully provided you with the potion that saved the day? Unbelievable! The winner of the second trial, Queen Amon Cookie, has also rescued her two rivals! Let us offer a generous round of applause to the bravery and selflessness of this champion! Amon Cookie! You were amazing today! M my friends! Not only did you pass the trial with flying colors, you also paved your own path as a paladin! <laughs> of course! You are everything a true paladin should be! I'm sorry about yesterday, but thank you. Truly, I wouldn't have gotten this far if not for your support. You have demonstrated that you are worthy of being called a paladin. Preceptor! A paladin never walks a well-trodden path. To push ahead in this wide world under the banner of the Divine Light, such is the way of a paladin of the Kremnite. And it seems that you have discovered a banner of your own indeed, Queen Amon Cookie. Keep walking that path, young one, and be the beacon of light to others. Yes, Preceptor. This trial has opened my eyes. I can feel it in my dough. The light within me feels stronger. My fellow paladins... 
I shall do it for the Creme Knights. For all of you. And for myself. I shall bring us victory. <sighs> Juice Cookie hasn't left his room since the end of the trial. I think he's busy preparing new potions. I want to offer my help, but I don't know if I should. Is everything all right, students? Is there a problem? Oh, hello, Principal Ma'am. Uh, Princess Cookie. Looks like facing the past has taken a greater toll on Prune Juice Cookie than he would like to admit. But I believe it will be a good opportunity for him to grow. It is very important to realize that overcome and get over are two different things. Let us wait, my young friends. Perhaps it is better if we gave Prune Juice Cookie some time to reflect on the events of today. Prune Juice Cookie, I only hope that you achieve all your goals at the end of this trial. Let's face it, my potions are all I have. What if Queen Amon Cookie didn't come for me today? What if I had to use my potions to solve this crisis? <laughs> Looks like I'm in her debt now. I must make more potions, greater quantities in all sorts. I must be prepared to solve any problems. I can't look them in their eyes. The biggest problem of all is not in the fact that I lacked skill or have let my school down. Capsaicin Cookie! Are you alright? We were so scared when Queen Amon Cookie brought you here! My friends. I'm sorry. I should have. No, stop it! Stop sulking! Keep your chin up! You've done more than well. No matter what you went through, you will always remain the pride of Scovilia! Yeah! We just got a bit scared as all! And the tournament is far from over yet! That's right. The biggest problem is... Huh? What? Hotwing! What's the matter? Ah, 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 ah! Calm down! What's wrong with you? That's your friend kept season cookie! Looks like Hotwing got too worked up with all that happened. This anxiety in me... That if I don't suppress the fire within me... I might end up burning everything around to ashes. We'll take care of Hot Wing. You go and have some rest. Thank you. Ah, what a thrilling tournament we have! Good morning! It is the day, the third trial. This time, our champions will have to descend into the depths of the Labyrinth Dungeon. Somewhere in the lab. They shall meet the mysterious Labyrinth Master, claim the mark of victory, and come back! Now, shall we begin? I bet this Labyrinth Dungeon is filled with hordes of magical creatures, just like yesterday's forest. Perhaps, or perhaps not. Also, if you didn't know, Labyrinths tend to be rather tricky to navigate. Prune juice cookie, your potion pouch looks heavier than yesterday. Well, last night I managed to identify 412 possible emergency situations we might come across today. With these potions in my bag, I'm pretty sure I can handle them with ease. 412? That's dedication. In case you haven't noticed, I'm quite desperate as well. Anyhow, looks like we're a team now. Well, I'm glad that I can hide behind your strong and reliable backs. All right, let's go. The 
deeper we go, the more damp the air gets. And darker, too. Hold on. It's not getting darker. The walls are covered in... something black. Hmm. I'm prepared for any kind of ambush. Here, let me... Black! It hurts. Oh? Wait. I can't see a thing. Also... <laughs> I mean... <laughs> I don't... <laughs> I can't stop! <laughs> Laughing! <laughs> what happened? Queen of mine, Cookie? What's the matter? Oh. Aha. Uh -huh. Only one thing that can cause that unstoppable laughter. The Muhaha Shroom. <laughs> watch your step. Specifically, watch out for that black liquid. Did you figure something out? No, not really. I'm just trying to act cautious and not end up in a funny situation like our friend here. Because who knows what awaits us around the next corner. <laughs> it's a bit too late for caution. You know something about this place, don't you? I won't pester you with questions. Just do something about her. Don't you have a potion prepared for that? You've got me there. I do owe our dear Queen Amon Cookie a favor. I'm the master of potions, after all, and it just so happens that I brought just the one. Here, have a sip of this, and try to swallow it as quick as you can. And just for the record, this makes us even. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Thank you! <laughs> How do you feel? Better? Ugh. More like... bitter. I do feel better. But the aftertaste... Looks like I forgot to sweeten your refreshment, my bad. But see, you finally returned to your senses. Many an unfortunate traveler met their... <laughs> bitter end, unable to stop their unending laughter. And if not for my potion, soon enough you would have realized this wasn't really a matter to laugh about, so to speak. Yes, you're right. Thank you, Prune Juice Cookie. Oh, how great it feels to be recognized. Hmm. Do you hear that? The wind. Oh. Cookies, I think I found something. expected you to find a way out so easily in all this darkness. Excellent! Let's get out of here. Huh. This place is a bit odd, don't you think? I agree. It seems like we're running in circles around a big chamber. Not to mention this place is weirdly damp, and those water sounds just before. Hmm. Perhaps there's an underground river nearby. Hmm. What's that smell? It smells like grass. Grass, huh? No, regular grass wouldn't have a smell that bitter. No, wait a minute. Close your eyes now. What? Ugh. What heaven? I can't move at all. <laughs> Tough luck. I wouldn't believe myself either. Fruit juice cooking! What did you do? My friend, it wasn't me. Look around. Or whoever still can, but be careful. This place is covered with basilisk ferns. What? Now? If you look right at them, they will paralyze you. 
Oh, what do we have here? The famous anti-basilisk potion. Unbelievable. I don't know if I'm impressed or a bold at you now. <sighs> Why are you drinking that? Ah, the sweet nectar of life. Excellent. This will buy me some time. Fruit juice cookie! Where are you going? To find the entrance to the inner chamber, of course. Aren't you gonna help us? <laughs> nah. Did you really think I wouldn't use this opportunity to get an upper hand? I only stayed with you lot because you were useful to me. Now, let's see. The entrance should be somewhere here. You little... Get you two. Two friends who are gonna lose together. Ah, very well. I'll give you a hint. Heat will indeed be quite helpful in your predicament. You see, the fern's paralyzing toxin is particularly weak against it. And if I were you, I'd save myself and leave Queen Amon Cookie here. Fruit juice cookie! Are you really gonna leave us here? Of course! After all, I've paid my debt to you. Word of advice? Do close your eyes sometimes, hmm? Ah, there you are. Right where I thought the door would be. <laughs> ah, don't you just love it when things go smooth as butter? I guess it's time for goodbyes. Huh? Is uh, crumbling apart. That door must have triggered a trap. Your season cookie. Use your powers right now. I can handle your heat. No, no, you're gonna burn into ashes. Burn juice cookie. Don't just stand there. Run. Save yourself! Huh? <laughs> Are you for real? Now? Yes! Our dose can take a hit or two, but a frail cookie like you will surely perish! Run! Save yourself! <laughs> Unbelievable. Oh, 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 oh. I can't believe I'm really doing this. Uh, desperate times call for desperate measures. Uh, I can't move again! Crude juice cookie. You. What are you looking at? Whatever you're about to say, save it. Run! We need to get out of here! If the, if the crash didn't crumble me, surely this run will! Is everyone in one piece? What is the matter with you? In case you forgot, we're competing against each other. Stop worrying about others and take care of yourself! Says the cookie that came back and saved us, nevertheless. <laughs> well, I like my victories clear and plain. I can't have other cookies accusing me of cheating. Hush! Why, both of you? The whole place is shaking! I can't figure out where this sound is coming from. It's so loud as if its source was right next to us. That's because it is right next to us! Queen of Mark Cookie, get down!
candy golem, an enormously large one. Ugh, must be the master of the labyrinth. Huh? We should be able to destroy it. Yeah. Huh? M my sword got stuck. Try to avoid direct contact. If you touch a candy golem, you'll get stuck to it. If you thought I'd stay still stuck to you, you couldn't be more wrong! Yeah! Oh, tore your sword off just like that. Do you always have to show off your strength in front of me? Is that golem really the master? Well, we don't have the luxury of doubt. Besides, did you look at its central part? Is that the relic we're supposed to retrieve? Yes, it's the mark of victory, which means... Let's defeat the golem first, and then decide what to do with the relic. Yeah! It's preparing to strike! Take cover! Nothing to worry about. Get down! Ah. Ah. Fruit juice cookie! Oh. He's fine. But his potions... The potions? Gone. The pouch helped to dampen the impact, but I'm alive, thanks to it. But without my potions, I'm useless. I won't be able to do anything. I'm nothing without my potions. Coach's cookie, snap out of it! Two of us, in one fell swoop. on the golem before, and I'm just a worthless little cookie. Think! I'm sure there is a solution. I didn't become a paladin to give up. Surely you've experienced obstacles during your potion crafting journey? Obstacles, yes. Rendered completely useless, never. It's not like I can brew potions out of thin air. Well, I don't know much about potions. But there must be something you can do! Maybe there's a way to use the golem's powers against it. Think! What it's made of, how it functions... Something! Don't tell me you're ready to just give up! I know you don't want to! Uh, if you're so smart, then perhaps... Wait a minute. Use the golem's powers, you say? That sounds like... Muhaha shrooms, basilisk ferns, running water, and this labyrinth structure... 
and a giant candy golem radiating with magic power? Maybe. Just maybe. Hmm. You big clods and your non-existent tactics. Do you even know how potion crafting works? Seriously, this is why you must pay attention in class. Potion making is a delicate craft, not some fetch and brew nonsense that just happens to solve everything. That sly smile. You came up with a plan, didn't you? Huh? A plan? To be frank, this is the most radical thing I've ever done. But I indeed do have a plan. Spill it! It's not like we have anything better to do right now. I'll do whatever you say. I knew it! <laughs> Listen up. I tell you to take notes, but this will have to do. We will use everything we've stumbled upon so far. The mushrooms, the ferns, running water, the golem, and... You, Capsaicin Cookie. Huh? Me? that you'll be able to follow my instructions word for word, so I'm going to simplify everything for your muscle brains. We are going to use the labyrinth structure and its ecosystem and turn it into a potion brewery. Our solvent is that candy golem. We're going to use the golem as the base for the potion. Huh? We have all the ingredients. The Muhaha Shrooms will become the stabilizer. And the Basilisk Ferns will be the catalyst that will help speed up the reaction. Which means, Capsaicin Cookie, your role is crucial in this escape plan. In order to fuse all the ingredients, we have to vaporize the river of this labyrinth and use steam instead. The labyrinth is too vast for any normal source of heat. We need flaming heat, like the one you demonstrated in the second trial. I... I understood the plan. But... I can't. I won't be able to control myself. I just can't. What are you... Do you even comprehend how dire this situation is? You just said you'll do whatever I say. But you two saw it too. I... I can't control my powers. But you can. What? I heard it loud and clear when I reached you in the Hall of Mirrors. You said you don't need those shackles anymore because you can control your powers. But I couldn't! I... I burnt down those woods with all their history and importance. There weren't any cookies around back then. But what if we didn't split up? What if we were all in the same room? You might have burned with the forest. And if I do what you told me, my flames are gonna get to you. I... I don't want to hurt cookies. Oh. <laughs> cookies born with strength, I swear. It's like their arrogance knows no bounds. Queen Amon Cookie, don't you have anything to say to that? Cookie, even if we were in the same Hall of Mirrors, we wouldn't have burned down. Prune Juice Cookie has his potions. And most of all, I would have stopped you from using your power freely. No, you haven't experienced the full scope of my strength. I, I've never unleashed my entire power. You, you were all too weak to face me in my full force. Did he just... Are you kidding me? That's it. I've heard enough. Yes, maybe in the eyes of the great Spice Overlord, some cookies may seem weak. But do you really think that all we can do is just stand there and suffer? Don't call me that! I never wanted to be called that name. Do you even know how hard it is to earn a title like that? An Overlord. Because you're that strong. Because everyone looks up to you and wants to be you. Oh, 
If only they could see you now. Pathetic. Whining like a freshly baked cookie without an ounce of common sense. What are you so scared of, overlord? Stop calling me that! The third child is in full swing right in the center of the labyrinth dungeon. The candy golem got a hold of the two contestants already. Oh no! Now it's coming for Capsaicin Cookie! Will the champions be able to make it? Besides, it looks like the champions are in the middle of a disagreement of their own. What? Are you gonna burn me to a crisp? It's not like we can do anything right now. Accidents happen when you least expect it. And once it's over, it's already too late. I didn't ask to be baked with all this power! And you think I want it to be baked frail? I... I'm always anxious because a single drop of my capsaicin essence might burn someone. But instead, I put a smile on and act all dependable. Or else the others would be terrified of me. Excuse me? Who is terrified of who? I'm pretty sure the only one terrified of you is yourself. Ugh. Both of you! Calm down! We need to work together! Not fight each other! Fine. You were chained down with shackles. Whatever. But clearly, you were able to get rid of them. That... That was just a lucky coincidence. Ha! Coincidence? Is that what you're calling your achievements now? Don't you see that you're the one shackling yourself? Do you think you're the only one with a hurtful past? Look at you. Unable to move on. Terrified to make another step. Prune juice cookie! Stop hiding from yourself! I never hid from anything! But... He's right. I... I ran away. I was scared of the harm my powers could cause. Chain myself away. Is it... Really okay to let it go? Will no one get hurt? Capsaicin Cookie! We'll be fine! We are the champions of our schools! The most capable and strongest of them all! If you get hurt, I will never be able to forgive myself. I couldn't care less about your conscience right now! I forgive you, so stop moping around! It cannot get any worse than this! Do you have to talk like that? Yes! Yes! Trust in us, Capsaicin Cookie! Everything will be fine. <sighs> All right. Here goes nothing. It's gonna get real hot now. Oh, that's it. You're on the right track. But you have to make it even hotter. Just a bit more. Yes! You can do it! Melt away your chains! The bind that you put on yourself! All right! All right! You asked for this! It's melting! No more. I will no longer chain myself to the past! Uh, almost there! Uh, the chamber is getting filled with steam! Ew! It's so humid and sticky. Prince Juice Cookie, are you alright? Of course I am. This is just another regular day in potion brewing. No more running away. These are my true powers. And I'm not afraid of them anymore! <laughs> it's working! Now, Capsaicin Cookie, give it everything you got. Maximum power! Here it goes! Witness the Spice Overlord's true might!
Is the yelling really necessary? <gasps> Capsaicin cookie! Watch out! Wait! I think I can fight the golem now! No. I know I can defeat it! I'll get to his core with my own hands! <gasps> Aiming for the golem's core directly? He got it! <laughs> burn me to ashes, I might have melted away in all this goo. So this is the power of potion making. I feel like I just sat through one of Parfadia's famous potion classes. Yeah, more or less. Does that mean I can send you a tuition bill later? <laughs> I see that you've fully recovered from the heat and reverted back to your usual joking self. <sighs> Oh, right. You did a good job, Capsaicin Cookie. I'll make an exception for you this time. I won't charge you for the lecture. Uh... Hmm. You're okay, right? Don't explode on us right now. I feel great! <laughs> huh. You made us go through all that trouble just to hear you say you're all refreshed now. Uh, forget about potion lectures. I should charge you for counseling. This relic is... I believe that's a relic from the founder of Parfadia. You're not plotting to steal it away from him, are you? Just what kind of cookie do you think I am? The relic's yours, Capsaicin Cookie. If you'd really gone berserk, the only cookie standing right now would have been you. Think of it as a prize for volunteering in my little experiment. And there we have it! Capsaicin Cookie has the mark of victory! He's lifting the golem's core up high! Scovilius Champion wins in the third trial! It looks like our three schools have earned one point each! Which cookie will take the triple cone cup? Find out in our finals tomorrow! We hope to see you there! Gelato Trio Cookie, coming to you live from the mountains of Trials and Harmony! Ha-ha! <laughs> Is that right? One point for each school! Nice! I look forward to battling you two once more. Now that I know you two are much more than some rookies, I'm gonna give it my best. It took you this long to realize this? I am always open to a good challenge. I honestly don't really care much for fighting, if I must say. I'm only the master of potions, so I'd rather sit in my corner and throw my vials from afar. You say that, but we know better. Yeah, you sure ain't gonna quit that easy. We... we can read you now. Like an open potions textbook. <laughs> <laughs> That's not funny at all. <laughs> all right then, it's settled. We shall see who the strongest cookie is in the upcoming finals. Yes! Let's! Rest up, you two. You'll be facing me now. I'm a whole new paladin. And I'm not gonna hold back anymore. You think you have what it takes to face everything I've got? Honestly, the Spice Overlord could do with some holding back. Ha! No can do! Crown Juice Cookie. Such is the fate of the brave ones who dare to awaken the Spice Overlord. Ah, uh, we really have to, though. Encouraging and helping out other contestants. I, was a... I 
know you two a lot. Thanks a bunch. It only makes sense to show you the full scope of my spicy powers, don't you think? <laughs> Prepare to face the Spice Overlord in his full glory! <laughs> Previously on the Triple Cone Cup, the three schools have gathered in the mountains of trials and harmony to find out the strongest flavor and cookie in the Triple Cone Cup. Scoville, the school of burning passion and spicy feats, with the Spice Overlord Capsaicin Cookie as its champion. Carthadia, the school of sweet dessert magic, with the Potion Master Prune Juice Cookie as its champion. The Krem Knights, the school of the noble paladins, with the undefeated paladin Queen Amon Cookie as its In the first trial, Prune Juice Cookie won by using his potions, leaving Queen Amon Cookie and Capsaicin Cookie in confusion. In the second trial, Queen Amon Cookie faced her fears and escaped the Hall of Mirrors first, claiming victory. In the third trial, Capsaicin Cookie embraced his true powers and defeated the Labyrinth's candy cup, winning the trial. The match returned to square one, with three schools earning one point each. Who will emerge victorious at the end? Overcome myself now. No more running away. Wow! That's our spice overlord. The spiciest of all time. Poor Hot Wing. Got too overexcited, it seems. It's all out of gas now. It's okay. I'm all right. I don't blame you at all, Hot Wing. That level of spice is not something you see every day, after all. Capsaicin Cookie! That's right! And Parfadia and the Krem Knights will be feeling the same! Ha <laughs> ha! That's what I'm talking about! While they're busy being shook, I'll steal the victory right out of their hands! <laughs> The sword! Our victor, Queen Amon Cookie! Our Queen Amon Cookie. So quick on her feet and swift in her movements despite the weight of her sword. It was a fine battle. Now, please rise. Of, of course! Thank you for making time for us on the day before the finals. It is truly an honor. 
No need to thank me. Had I not been able to train with you all, none of this would have been possible. So I would like to formally take this opportunity and offer my thanks to you. Queen Amonkali! The finals are tomorrow. The time to shine the glorious light of Krem Knights has come! I would be lying if I said I was satisfied with the result of the third trial. But I know I am shining brighter than ever. And it gives me strength. I am ready for the finals. Krem Knights! Please support me until the end! So, do you hear anything? Stop pushing! We're gonna get caught. And who might you be caught by? <laughs> Prune juice cookie, of course. Brewing portions takes a lot of concentration. After all, we mustn't disturb him. Uh... Then what should you do if you've already been caught? P Prune juice cookie! We've been caught! If that's all, could I be excused? I'm in quite a hurry, you see. For making a potion? I mean... Yes! So creative! I can't believe potions are so versatile! Oh, compliments like that won't get you anywhere with me, you know. Ah! That, that, that's not what I... It's just... We were just... Is there something we could help you with? We just want to show our support, that's all. <laughs> uh, wizards, ever so fickle. So, you're fine with storing potions all night long, for hours and hours and hours until you get cramps. Oh, you did all that by yourself until now? Then, so will I. We have plenty of cookies here willing to help, so we can take turns. Just tell us where to start. Do you all remember the journey our three champions have been through on their way here? After three tries, the score is tied. All three schools have put up an amazing performance. Then, are you ready to greet our three champions once more? Speak of the Devil, Arthania, headed by their champion, Rune Juice Cookie, is entering the stadium as we speak! Coon Juice Cookie, who proved that sharp intellect and wit are just as amazing as physical strength. Please, give us a comment. Ah, of course. Well, now that I've made it this far, I might as well use the opportunity to show the world who the best potion maker is. Imagine! Crunchy's Cookie has been doing all this on his own! Moving on, the Krem Knight's champion, Queen Amon Cookie, is entering the stadium! The noble paladin, blessed by the light itself, Queen Amon Cookie! How are you feeling? I'll show you what being a paladin means to me. I hope for this to be a true challenge. Queen Amon Cookie, show them the true meaning of integrity! The victory belongs to the Kremnites! The last cookie to enter the stadium is... Skullvillia's champion, Capsaicin Cookie! Nothing gets spicier than this! His spicy dough surprised everyone from the beginning of the tournament! The Spice Overlord born from boiling magma! Capsation Cookie of Scovillia, how are you? I'm burning up! I'm about to explode! Whoa, so spicy! Show them the meaning of the spice! Those cheers are blazing hot! 
Let me introduce the rules of the finals. Did you all notice? Flames are burning in the colors of each school above the stadium. Remember how the goal of the first trial was to light up the bonfire? Here, in the finals, you must light up three bonfires to win. Welcome to the Battle of the Bonfires! <laughs> Very well. I won't let my guard down this time. <sighs> I suppose the finals won't be easy. I'm not the same cookie you met in the first try. Watch out! <laughs> the stakes are high. Things are about to get intense. And our champions are more motivated than ever. Which cookie will be able to light up all bonfires and have the glorious flames burn until the very end? The final try, Triple Cone begins right now! The Spice Overlord will show him how it's done. The final trial has just started, and Capsaicin Cookie has immediately surrounded the Scovillia Bonfire with a ring of flames. That was a predictable move. With this heat, Capsaicin Cookie has definitely become stronger. I feel it. Hmm. Made a wall of flames around your bonfire, have we? However, will I take your fire now? Defense before offense. It won't be an easy win for you this time. You're right about defense, but I won't let you get your way. Any paladin worth their salt knows the value of defense, which means they know the weak spots of those defending as well. You called us weak in the labyrinth, remember? I'll make you regret saying that word. Yeah! Queen Amon Cookie rushes straight towards Capsaicin Cookie. And on attack like that will be rough, even for Capsaicin Cookie. That's the spirit! You attempt to take my sword head on? Impressive, I must say. Then, do your best! Cookie have brought Queen of On Cookie's attack! It's neck to neck. Neither of them seem to be backing down. You're the spiciest! Capsation Cookie! As I expected, you put up a good fight! Ha! Neither of you is strong enough to face my full power! So you've decided to have a little chat during the final trial. <laughs> strong cookies are all the same. You two stay in your own little world. For now, it's time for Prune Juice Cookie to make a run for victory. Taking advantage of Queen Amon Cookie and Capsaicin Cookie's face-off, Prune Juice Cookie makes a run for the Krem Knight's bonfire. You think I'll let you get away with that? Capsaicin Cookie uses his fire to block Prune Juice Cookie's path. That trick won't work twice. Your fire stands no chance against my potions. Wait, this heat! My potions are not designed for such temperatures. I told you, the capsaicin cookie you knew is gone! The spice overlord is burning up! The Krem Knight's bonfire will be Scovilia's! Capsaicin passes through his own wall of fire and... The Krem Knight's bonfire turns red! Ha ha ha! Just one more to go! Don't worry, I'll make the Parfadia bonfire burn just as brightly! <laughs> you think I will let you? Queen Amon Cookie is running towards the Parfadia bonfire! So, you think you can just pass through my fire? Ha 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 ha! Awesome! Show me what you've got! Once again, Capsation Cookie uses flames to block the path to the Parfadia bonfire. Will Queen Amon Cookie be held back? No 
chance. Queen Amon Cookie runs through the wall of fire with no hesitation. She passed through the fire? What was that just now? That flash of golden light? And in a flash, the Parvadia bonfire has changed to a bright yellow. Oh goodness, Queen Amon Cookie. Your dress looks a little charred. You can burn my dress, but never my unwavering conviction. I thought I would be unable to pass through. Paladin, I am now. As long as you have no fear, there is no challenge you cannot face. She keeps surpassing her own limits. That's our Paladin, Queen Amon Cookie. Looks like Parvati is in trouble, but the trial is far from over. Rune Juice Cookie surely has a couple of tricks up his sleeve. This heated situation is hardly optimal. But I can't sit back and do nothing. I'll make everything burn blue. Not for anyone else, but for me. Moon Juice Cookie is revealing something. Could it be a new weapon that will turn the tide for Parvadia? Here I go, my strongest potion. I am already aware of your strength. But the tricks you used in the first trial won't work again. I'll send those potion bottles of yours flying. Did you really expect me to use the same tactics twice? The direction of the firewall around the Scovilia bonfire. It's changed! The fire has magically changed direction. Is this even possible? It's now blocking Queen Amon and Capsaicin Cookie's view. Now there's nothing in Prune Juice Cookie's way. He runs and... I was gonna save that for last, but it's no use if I've already lost by then, is it? That was my newest work. I call it the I do whatever I want potion. If I can't reduce the strength of your fire, I'll just change its direction. <laughs> This fierce battle is making it impossible for anyone to get ahead. I wonder which color will light up the stadium. I never thought this was going to be easy, but this is getting quite fun. I have no intention of letting this end in a draw, because there's only going to be one winner. Me! Finally, something I can relate to. Although I must correct you on one thing. Winner will be me, Prune Juice Cookie. We are continuing our broadcast of the fierce battle taking place at the Triple Cone Cup Stadium, thanks to the All Seeing Jelly Visor. The intense fight has left the arena loose, but look, the bonfires are still intact. Although the leadership is going back and forth. The score remains the same. It's one to one. Keep watching to see how this unpredictable Triple Cone Cup will end. How are you feeling after having ruined the whole arena? I have to say, I'm starting to regret helping you out in the third try. It can't be helped when you're pouring your potions everywhere, can it? That's right. That strange potion has made everything so slippery. It's not a strange potion. I'll have you know it's actually titled Watch Out, Banana Peel. <laughs> you cookies really crack me up. But if you still have the energy to mess around like this, then... The Overlord has descended upon the stadium. Now, Stacey, he is clearing up the wreckage of the arena with magic. You said you could handle my strength? Then feel it all at once! The Overlord is free! The Black 
covered wreckage is hitting Queen Amon Cookie and Cook Juice Cookie. We believe in you, Queen Amon Cookie! Our juice cookie, watch out! I told you strength alone won't get you anywhere too far. But having watched you two, I've learned a couple things as well. Using your resources creatively can get you out of the trickiest of situations. Potion still doesn't have a name, but how about something like, uh, Anti-Overlord Solution? Corrupt are bursting into darkness, flying right towards Capsaicin Cookie and Queen Amon Cookie. I knew you'd be a tough opponent. That's why. I am not afraid. I will not give up! So that I can always be Cookie, you're shining so bright! Queen Amon Cookie channels the strength of the light to defend herself against the rock fragments. Ah, it's too bright! I cannot see a thing! What about Queen Amon Cookie? Fruit Juice Cookie, answer! Capsaicin Cookie's gonna be alright. Right? right? <laughs> Hot Wing! What's wrong? What? What in the light's name is that? Is that? I realize we're in the finals, but isn't this taking it to the extreme? It's coming! The Queen of Monk could keep you okay? Goodness! I mean, is this really happening? A gigantic golem has entered the arena! Looks similar, but different at the same time! True. It's not just the size, the components look different as well. Huh? Huh? The bonfire, the golem... All things we have previously conquered. Is that the meaning of this? To learn from previous challenges? Stand back! Something's not right here. This is not what we were told! This is not a regular candy golem! We must evacuate all students at once! <laughs> Golem is destroying the stadium. This, oh no, this is an emergency. Every evacuate immediately. The students gotta go first. I will make a path for the exit. Everyone over here. Be careful not to get hurt. Everyone, calm down and follow the rescue gelato. <laughs> This is Gelato Trio Cookie. We are evacuating to escape the golem that is broken into the stadium. The ground shakes with its every giant step. Eva evacuation will not be easy. 
Cover your heads and do your best not to crumble. Can't you protect yourself sometimes, too? That thing over there is nothing like the golem we fought previously. Grown Juice Cookie, get out of there at once! This is no time for curiosity and adventurousness! If the principle is this stern, it must mean it's really dangerous. I'm gonna knock down that huge thing and become even hotter! This thing shown up at the stadium. This is the birthplace of the Triple Cone Cup. The odds are fast, and the flavors left behind by the three cookies have faded. Anything could be looking around in this stadium. Well, that still doesn't change the fact that all we need to do is defeat it. I have told you this before. A paladin unable to protect themselves is unable to protect anyone else. Just think, if the golem that was lurking underneath Yurita escapes the stadium, mountains of trials and harmony are doomed. That's why we can't just stand back like this! I'll make sure that golem doesn't take another step! Do not take the golem on alone, Capsaicin Cookie. I can't let you have all the honor to yourself. For Cauldron's sake, how do they get involved with cookies like you two? This is ridiculous. Is this really happening? And why do I completely agree with you, even though you're being so impossibly reckless? Chrome Juice Cookie, be careful. It's up to you to make the right choice. Those young rascals are so stubborn. Hi, young cookies! Lure the golem away so that it doesn't escape from the arena! And that's how Scovelia handles things! Ha! Just leave it to us! That can't possibly be our plan! Calm down, please. The Scovelia Headmaster does have a point. We have a duty to get everyone out of here safely, not just our champions. We must hold the monster back with the help of our champions. Queen Amon, and I trust you with this task. It would be an honor, Preceptor. Groom Juice Cookie. I can rely on your resourcefulness and perseverance, yes? I admit I am rather tired, but if that's what I must do, very well. I'll say it one more time, you three! It's no time for foolish bravado. Your goal is not to defeat the golem, but to keep it in the arena as long as possible. Champions, I wish you luck. Touch even a crumb on any of these cookies! To your positions! Let's finish this! This thing is so huge! 
It won't melt at all! Stop attacking and focus on distracting it then. One, all right. Where did it come from? Hmm. Grinch's cookie. You came up with a plan, right? Well, not exactly a plan. More like a theory. Then spell it and quick. I really wish I was wrong. It's approaching the crowd. Over my frozen body. Take this! The golem turns to the flames! So it can sense heat! It's not just any kind of heat. It's the flames of the Spice Overlord! So, what's going through that head of yours, Prune Juice Cookie? I think we may have summoned this golem. Say what now? Think about it. We're a bit out of depth here. Remember the third trial. Ha! Queen Among Cookie, get down! Ah! Did... Did you just throw a potion at me? If it weren't for my potion, you would have crumbled away. Don't worry. I won't get caught like last time. I'm not hesitating anymore! I'd really rather not repeat another lecture on potions. But I think this golem is here because of our little experiment. What? Simply put, the candy golem from the trial dissolved into a potion. That potion was absorbed by the Earth and created a chemical reaction with something laying dormant down there for all those years. And that golem we see is a result of that? In essence, yes. Something of that sort. It wasn't just any kind of golem, but a golem with a relic as its core. Not only did we create a potion of such dangerous power, we basically threw it away. Any potion maker cookie would have been appalled. What was I thinking? Such a rookie mistake! But... Why now? Why did it appear here? That's also because of us. I mean, look at the ground you're standing on. Just think, three cookies have been wreaking absolute havoc in the arena. Anyone would want to come up and see what that chaos was all about. like the golem from the labyrinth. That means that thing also has a core, right? And we can extract it, just like last time. The conditions are vastly different. That thing is so big, even your heat can't melt it. And we're in an open space. Yes, yes. It looks like my potions class has taught you something. Don't forget that unlike last time, we don't know where the golem's core is. But if we do find the core, we can stop it! How? Were you not listening? We just need to keep the golem busy for as long as we can! And then what? Have you thought of what comes next? The headmasters are doing their best to protect the spectators. But someone needs to actually stop the thing for good. You're right! Yes, of course I'm right. Ha <laughs> ha! Yes! Let me lure the golem away from the exit. Then I shall find the location of the golem's core. It's gotta be tougher to get through than the other parts of its body. Then I'll try to whip something up to melt the weight of the core. Ha <laughs> ha! 
foolish golem. Take this! We'll make you regret crawling all the way up here. Looks like the fun is about to begin. This is Gelato Trio with the latest news. First, we have the noble and mighty headmasters with us here. For the record, I am not scared of the golem. It's the journalist's duty to show you the entire picture, not just the main hero of the story. Yes. Let the light shine the way! Fire! Power of sugar and fruit nectar, I beseech you! Pour over sweet syrup onto these sacred grounds! The Headmasters! They're protecting us! A force that encompasses the entire field! Wicked cool! Grandmites, evacuate the premises immediately! We can't just leave everything to Queen Amon Cookie! This is no longer just a game. Pepsi Zinkuki, is she gonna be okay? That thing looked way stronger than the candy golem from the dungeon. Listen up! Just this one. Need you all to calm down! Do you think we can help Rouge's Cookie in any way? Students of Parfadia, we need to be smart and quick. The situation is dire. Madam Principal, isn't there anything we can do to help Juice Cookie? Anything! Like stopping the golem from escaping the field? Then, we're gonna help Capsaicin Cookie too! We may not be as hot and spicy as Capsaicin Cookie. There must be something we can do. Let us aid Queen Amon Cookie! We are paladins of the Krem Knights as well! You lot! Only those who return safely will be able to witness the light's glory. Are you truly prepared? After all these years, you students never cease to amaze me. Is Gelato Trio Cookie overcoming my fears? Coming live from the stadium. There, there's the scene. There's Gelato Trio Cookie to tell you everything about it. Our champions are still struggling against the mysterious Gotham. Oh, this thing is getting stronger and faster! Have you located its core yet? Yeah! It keeps protecting its chest with its arms! It's clearly somewhere there, but I don't know the exact location yet! Think, think, think. A way to destroy the core? this one. Oh no! The Gollum's fist is heading straight at Capsaicin Cookie! <coughs> the flaming offering has pushed Capsaicin Cookie out of the Gollum's way! I've never seen such speed! And Capsaicin Cookie is safe! I think I'm going to break into tears! Such friendship is truly sensational! Hardwing! <laughs> you came all the way here to save me! That's amazing. What? What are you all doing here? I thought you all evacuated! Bring them on, Cookie! We Queen shall Queen assist you! My fellow paladins! Queen Queen Jesus. Jesus. Queen 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 huh? But why? To to help me? St 
students of Parthadia? Use your defense magic to protect the other students! Yes, ma'am! Scobelia! Help get Zeus and Cookie and distract the golem! Yeah! Red Knights! Assist Queen of Mount Cookie! Yes, By my own, I will find that poor. Let's show what Scophilia is all about! Just some moments ago, our chances were pretty slim. Looks like there's hope after all. With the force of all three schools. We can do it! Queen Amon Cookie, have you found it? That's the sound of Queen Amon Cookie's blade. That's it! I know how we can destroy the Golem's core! So listen up, we're gonna reenact the explosion from just before the Golem appeared. Gonna use that anti-overlord solution again? Yes, but this time, we're gonna need everyone's help. We'll pulverize those rocks with the force of light. An order of one blazing hot stadium coming right up! Scovilia, give them your fiercest and hottest fire! Parfadia, prepare your explosion spells. I'll support you all with amplification potions. Paladins of the Kremenites, gather your light and focus it here! One! Two! worked! <gasps> we stopped the golem! <laughs> that was spicy! <laughs> this is the Triple Cone Cup Stadium. And those who are watching through the all-seeing jelly puzzle Great pleasure to report that the three schools have joined their forces and successfully stopped the mysterious golem. Where could that golem have come from? We might never know. Personally, I'm going to show you whatever I can find today. Perhaps the headmasters can explain this phenomenon. This too is the will of the divine. Fate does work in mysterious ways. And let's find out how it worked this time. Cap Sacy Cookie! That was. That was amazing! I've never felt my cookie don't boil like that! 
in a mon cookie. You truly are an exemplary paladin. Granger's cookie skills are the real thing. <laughs> what are y'all talking about? We all stopped the bombs. Not just us three. This whole recognition thing is new. Oof. You mean exciting, not new. Don't sneak up on me like that. I'm just a frail little cookie, remember? <laughs> Twas an experience that I will never forget. So, the question is, who wins the Triple Cone Cup? Are you still talking about the cup? After all we've been through together? I've earned something more valuable than a trophy. It does not matter who won. Yeah, and I burned all those shackles away while battling you two. I can blaze on however I want. If it weren't for our light, without Queen Amon Cookie, Capsation Cookie wouldn't have been able to win in the third trial. How can you say that after witnessing Virgil's Cookie's potions? It was Virgil's Cookie that they overlooked solution that defeated that Gollum! And if it were there, all the rules of that Gollum's fist! Haha. <laughs> The good old competitive spirit. You think after everything we've been through, we'd be past this, but. Hmm. Then, how about this? Everyone from the three schools will join us and compete for the cup. Good idea! Don't tell me you two still have the energy to go on, because I'm simply exhausted. Though, I will say, working together wasn't too bad. That this is our moment, cookies. Let's show the flame and spirit of Scovillia. Let's go. Uh, I, I think we're having the real, actual finals right now. That wasn't in the rules. Yes, that's the spirit of Scovillia. This is our chance to go home with that cup. The flames of Scovillia will burn you all! Dear students of Parfadia, please do your best and show what you are all capable of. Let them taste the unique flavors of Parfadia. Paladins of the Krem Knights, let the lights listen. Bring you victory! It looks like the three headmasters have agreed to go forth with this unexpected development. The true finals start now! Yeah! Oh, no!